I recently lost membership on a majority of my accounts and my method of choice to re-obtaining membership is by high risk fighting skills picks. And he's dead. Thank you. Free dragon claws, free primis. That is 92 mil. Divided by six mil per bond, that's uh, 15 bonds. Quick mats. And now that I have membership on all my accounts, there is only one thing left I need to do before PK, and that is to decorate my walls using this plate. And luckily for all of us, this plate happens to be today's video sponsor. This plate is the 21st century's way to put art on your wall. This plate is a metal poster designed to capture your unique passions. Whether you like movies, animals or landscapes, there will be a unique design just for you. Mounting a display plate on a wall is super easy, no tools are required, you just put a sticker on the wall, then you place the magnet on this sticker and it's done. I personally got 3 display plates on my wall, I got a lion, I got a mountain and I got a runescape map as well. And for every display sold, one tree is planted in Africa. And if you purchase this plate using my link, you get 23% discount if you buy one or two and 29% discount if you buy three or more. Discount will automatically be applied if you use my link in the description down below. He's on a farm run. Okay, I got a TV. Yep, he's dead. 98kk. Oh. Disappointing. Oh, there's a level 35. Okay, wait. What account do I have? I bonded up this D bowler. Oh, I killed him. Keen knees. Blood ruse. Oh, wait, 2k blood ruse. Anything else? No, that's it. The bond cost 5 mil and we made 750k, which means we lost 4 mil on this PK. While I was here, I continued hopping and I found two more rune crafters, both level 3s. Wait, there's two level 3s? And after discovering they both had over 90 rune crafting, I decided to bond up another account and go for them. What? I can't attack. Look, I think he's fake logged. My guess right here is that he's used a fake log so no one can attack him while he is botting. So unfortunately we did not get to know how many blood runes these people were carrying and we also lost 5 mil on bonding up this account. Every time I edit a video, I'm usually in the Lumbridge basement waiting for unsuspecting PKers to buy gloves. And that's what I'm doing in this video as well. Oh, I killed someone. Oh, there's a whip on the ground. Thank you. Coins. One mil. Okay, thank you. Who's this? What? No way, what? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. No way, no way, no way, that just happened. He was Max Max. What? What just happened? 95 mil PK? And I'm like messing around. What just happened? We got the Crystal Armor, Dragon Fire Ward, AGS. I'm happy, I'm happy. 96 mil PK for this adventure video, okay. Good start. Oh my, this guy I just killed. If we add him, he's double name changed. <laughs> I decided to do a monster clue scroll which have been rotting in my bank for so long. And we're gonna open it, three, two, one. Absolutely nothing. I got someone and he was just in a fight and I pitched him. Shit. 
Well, that's fun. <laughs> Welcome to Rot December. Honestly, I kinda deserve that for PJing their fight. Instant karma. You know what they say, if you win a stake of the dying, it's as if you never died. Well, I lost that stake, so I'm down double. I found this random bronze account running up north from Ulan Bridge, so I followed him. And while I killed him, I found a splasher by the cows. So I killed him too. What the? This is the weirdest thing I've ever witnessed. Oh, big cave? 471k, that's so weird. And he's dead! Nice, kill. Good fight, sir. 2.6 mil. I'll take it. Oh, it's the Axu guy. And his friend, I guess. That? Oh my, I killed him. I actually killed him in front of his friend. Brimstone ring, hell yeah. Uh, oh, a solid 4.9 mil. Thank you. Every now and then I scout for players with private on in PvP worlds so I can invade their house and this guy just happened to have private on. Is that Inkage is dead? That's a lot of law runes. What? 10,000 law runes? Oh my god, a dust battle staff? So I was recently in a discord call with Framed where he was pretending to be a noob while peeking and he was sharing his screen and I noticed how one guy was following him into the Varak sewers in Multi. So I decided to gear up my account and try to tell block him and kill him. Kevin, confirm, is it world 539? Uh, 539, yeah. yeah. I'm in the cellar right now. I'm in the cellar. Wait, Kevin, if you just last for a bit longer, like, try running away from him a bit. I'm almost there. I'm almost there. Wait, don't... <laughs> <laughs> I'm in the cellar. He's TB'd. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> I cannot believe that, Tom, you are a hero. What was going oh on? God. You know, I don't, I don't even, Tom, you deserve all of this, dude. Do you know how quickly I geared up for that? <laughs> That's the freest loot ever. And speaking of free loot... How is he already dead? Wait, did I even protect- What am I doing, man? Alright, that's like, uh, two bonds, I think, from this kill. Now I can go back to my hardcore Iron Man. And he's dead. I haven't killed anyone for Black Shins in a while, so... Interesting. 500k, okay. For some reason, I always find odd things happening outside of Ferox Enclave. Who was here? And he's dead. I 3 hit him. 500k. I'll take that. Thank you very much. Need gloves, you dumbass. And you're a dead, my friend. 300k. Okay, I see someone. Please don't splash. Thank you. Should be enough to kill him, right? Scratch. Oh, thank god I kill him. No way, is this. What? Oh my god! What? No way! What? It actually happened! I finally got some up for a lot while AFKing here in the basement. 79 mil. That claw scratch. Oh my god! Then I've been camping here for over 100 hours. Let's go! I got it! That will be the final kill of the video. However, during my stay at the Lambridge basement, I started getting ragged after trying to kill a guy coming down here. He ragged me for over two hours. No matter where I went, he found me. I changed locations and worlds, and within seconds, he found me every single time. And there is a good reason why he found me. 
You see, I logged into an alt account to scout whenever he leaves so I could go back to the basement and I befriended him and I told him I would give him CNN's locations and that's what I did. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Where is this dragger? He told me to add and I'm telling him I'm here right now. I wonder if I can get some GP out of him. You ain't got a spot in it. My plan with this ragger is very simple. I'm gonna change locations all the time and instantly DM him about C Engineer's location and I'm gonna gain his trust. Hi sir, he says. I'm pretending to be shocked. After teleporting away on C Engineer, he traded my alt. <laughs> no way! Oh my, he's giving me five mil! This guy has been ragging me all day and I managed to convince him to give me 5 mil without him knowing. So this ragger wants my all to keep finding C Engineer so he can keep ragging C Engineer. And that's what I did. What you doing here he asks. I'm just good in the game. Normally what these raggers want is for you to give them GP for them to stop ragging you. In this case he wanted 20 mil. And at one point he even threatened to rag me for lifetime. Uh, which might actually be true because whenever this video comes out he might be very furious and actually rag me for a life so I'm a bit scared. <laughs> He's friend of mine if you kill your rag lifetime. Oh boy. But let's make lifetime already. Good luck. He says come castle wars your world. And you know I'm here, baby. How much is gonna give me? Oh, another five mil! <laughs> I made ten mil from two hours of pretending to be ragged. After getting this five mil, I got pretty bored, so I decided to log off C Engineer. It was 3 a.m., I was tired as well. And he ended up giving me another ancient dehyde body and a Darox axe, so another 700k. Put your private on. I PM you with other account because he can get me banned. He knows he can get banned from ragging as well. <laughs> Two days later, he once again wants CNN's locations and I give it to him. And in return, I got another 2 mil from him. So in total, I've made 15 mil from this ragger. Being up 15 mil from a ragger, I'd like to call that a massive success. I feel like I could have milked this guy for so much more GP, but it just isn't worth my time. We had our fun, we had our laughs, let's now move on in life. And with that kill, I wanna say some final words. Thank you for this year. You guys have allowed me to do something I never thought I would do. I actually quit my job a few months ago uh, to try out full-time YouTube, and it's been working great so far. And hopefully 2022, will be a much greater year. Thank you guys for watching. A like is always appreciated. And I will see you next year. Thank you and goodbye.